Hello everyone. So today I am going to teach you this animation that is the name subscribe button and this is the final look that I am going to teach you. Uh, this is the animation that I have created in Canva. So if you want to create this kind of animation for your subscribe button then let's jump to the video. So first you have to open your Canva home page and then click on this video tab and now select this video dimension 16 is to 9 now you are having with a blank page and on this blank page we will create a subscribe button with the name of your youtube channel you can insert the logo of your youtube channel and you can also write down the name of your youtube channel and the purpose of your channel along with the subscribe button and the bell icon so this is a small animation that I will create with the green screen and that green screen can be removed uh, while you are editing your video. So first when you are with your blank canvas or a blank screen then first in the first step just change the color of this page as green. I am changing the color as green but this color is not so bright so I am going to change the shade of this green color like this because I want a bright green shade and after this insert a shape insert a rectangle with the round corner so from the shape section you will be having this rectangle with the round corner so I'm going to click on this and just drag the handles of this rectangle so that we can create a big rectangle like this and now change the color of this rectangle as white or if you want any other color you can insert that color I want a white color so that's why I have given white color to this rectangle now I want to insert a small logo of my or a small profile picture uh, of my youtube channel for that I need a canvas then click on element section and then write down frames In the frame section you will be having a round frame that will help us to insert the picture of our YouTube channel. So decrease the size of this frame and then insert it on the left side. You can set the size of your logo as according to your choice. I want this much of the size so I have set like this and now I am going to insert the picture of my YouTube channel. So in the upload section I have already uploaded that picture. I am going to drag that image. So it will be look like this. So the name of my channel is learn online lesson. So after that I am going to write down this. For writing the name of my youtube channel I required text tab. And then I am going to click on this add a heading. And I am writing the name of my channel like this. Now I have to decrease the size of this text like this. The size is currently 92 but I want to decrease that. So I have set on 48. I am increasing this text as 51. Okay. And now I am going to insert one more line uh, by clicking on add a subheading and uh, I'm writing about my channel here as I always teach animations in Canva so I have written animation tutorial channel if you want to write down any other thing or if you want to describe your channel in your own way you can write that and I'm decreasing the size so 21 is not a good size so I am setting as 32 and I am changing uh, the effect as italic and now I need a subscribe button here. So for that I have selected element section and I am writing subscribe button here. So I am going to take this subscribe button but I don't want this bell icon so I am going to crop that and I am decreasing the size of the subscribe button like this 
and I'm going to place the button here. Now I want to insert bell icon also. So for that I'm increasing this rectangle a little bit and then I'm writing bell icon in the element section search. So I found this bell here. The color of this bell is black but I will change the color. So first I have placed the bell here and then I'm going I have decreased the size of this bell a little bit and I'm placing this on the right position and I want to change the color of this bell so I have set the color as red okay now I am going to group this whole work by selecting all the objects together and click on this group button and uh, I want to insert some animation so for that I will select this animate tab and uh, I am just trying two or more option the first option is wipe here I am going to click on that but I want this wipe option only on the entry so I'm going to click on this button on enter so this animation is look like this so now I'm going to duplicate this but on the duplicate frame I don't want any animation so I have selected this object and on the wipe option I'm going to remove the animation because on this particular portion I don't want any animation so now it will be looking like this this is the animation and on the second frame I don't want any animation okay and now I'm going to decrease the size of this first frame that I have created as 2.5 so this is the entry of our animation so I have set the size of this first frame as two seconds okay and on the second frame i will insert one click animation so i'm writing hand click and then i will click on this see all and i'm searching for a right click option i think this one is the best or the good one I like this one so I am just placing this hand near the subscribe button and I am decreasing the size of this frame also as 2.4 and I am duplicate this frame in the third frame I will change the position of this hand and I will place this hand near the bell okay so this way I have created the animation so I am going to play this animation to check my work this is the first one and this is the second one and this is the third one okay so I am feeling that I should decrease the size of this first one as 1.5 and uh, I am going to duplicate this first one and I'm placing this duplicate portion at the back of the third frame and uh, on the third frame I want to insert some animation and for that I will click on that animate and I will select that wipe and on exit okay so this is my final work and now I will going to play this animation so this way you can create your animation I think all these steps are clear to you and if you have liked my video or if you have liked the way I have taught you all the steps then do let me know in the comment section and also let me know that if you want me to create 
a video on any other topic do not forget to like my video and don't forget to subscribe my channel so see you in the next video bye bye